and welcome back to Madeira. We're back to Casa de Bruno, our official spot at Ilha da Madeira for the moment. There has been some upgrades here as he is uh, treating pretty well his backyard, which comes in quite of a challenging situation. It's pretty, pretty cool. That's the house and that's the view. All good? Baby. So basically that's Ilha da Madeira. This is Funchal. This is us. A lot to explore in this place. And something tells me that we'll have a lot of time to keep exploring this island. <laughs> Island of Madeira, nothing special, just a little track. Second season of exploring Madeira. Getting out for the day. The weather on the weather on our side of the island is uh, not the greatest. A bit wet, but as is uh, very well known in Madeira, from one side of the island to another, things can change very rapidly. Okay, so as predicted, we've arrived at the other side of the island 
and the weather is just perfect. We had lunch already, we had the time to do a bit of a turn around the west coast of the island. And we arrived here. What's the name again? Jardim do Mar. Jardim do Mar. And this time, we're back to Madeira with Francois, which is uh, having fun surfers. She's about to get wet. <laughs> It was not possible to avoid getting a little bit wet. <laughs> That's it. That's why we came to Ilha da Madeira this time. Those cows might be our new neighbors in the near future. And a very nice view. That's it. That was the actual reason we went back to Ilha da Madeira. Because uh, after our first visit, we kind of got a little bit hooked by this place. We started to dream about it and to see a lot of potential and considering a place to invest, uh, to have something for ourselves for the future. And we think this looks not that bad. 